So it's great to have the Square Kilometre Array headquarters based at Jodrell Bank. In fact, there's a very long history to this. Uh, uh, many of the staff in the Jodrell Bank Centre for Astrophysics were involved in SGA right from its very early start many, many years ago. And uh, in 2011, uh, the SGA organisation was set up at Jodrell Bank in the original building there. They're now going to become an international governmental organisation, so something very much like CERN in Geneva. And so it is great to have a world-class project with its headquarters based at Jodrell Bank. Mm -hmm. Well, the great thing is, is that uh, they have something like six uh, major projects and uh, all of them are essentially potentially uh, Nobel Prize winning physics and, uh, and of course some of them are involved with uh, um, testing uh, ideas from very famous physicists from the past like uh, Albert Einstein and checks on general relativity. Um, they will be also looking at uh, um, some parts of the radio spectrum that is sensitive to gravitational waves and of course, there's a, there's the biggest uh, uh, physics result last year was on gravitational waves using a completely different technique, of course, but it does mean that there's uh, lots of fantastic science coming out. Uh, one of my staff once referred to uh, SGA as CERN in the sky, uh, which I think was a very nice description because most people have heard of CERN. Um, I'm a particle physicist myself, and CERN is famous for discovering many important things in particle physics. Uh, I've no doubt that uh, in a few years time from now that SK will be well known for making some really fundamental discoveries in, in astrophysics.